happy learning everyone! Welcome back to my YouTube channel! Kung bago ka pa lang sa akin channel ay huwag mong kalimutang mag-subscribe at i-click mo na rin ang bell button para updated ka sa mga susunod ko pang mga videos. Happy learning class! How are you doing today? I hope you're all good. Please stay home and keep safe. Before we proceed to our topic, let us have a quick review to bridge our lesson for today. In the story to were left, Lonnie and Nimuk were left on a place like this. What do we call this? If your answer is iceberg, yes, you are correct. Iceberg comes from the words ice and bird that have different meanings. Ice means solid state of water, while bird means mountain of glacier. This results to iceberg, which means floating ice that has separated from glacier. We will notice that from two individual words having different meanings, we can form a new word with its own meaning as well. What do we call these words? We call this compound words. And what are compound words? Compound words are words formed by putting two or more words together to form a new word with a new meaning. Compound words has its three types. Namely, closed, open, and hyphenated compound words. Close compound word written with no space between words. Examples are windmill, someone, airplane, newspaper. While open compound words are written with space between words. Examples are time zone, home port, hot dog. The other one is Hyphenated compound words, which are written with hyphen in between words. Examples are mother-in-law, mother of pearl, son-in-law, passers-by, name-calling. Now, let's try this one. Let us identify the words that make up the following compound word. Provide the meaning for each individual word and for each compound word. Background, runner-up, high school. Back, which means the side or part of something that is away from the spectator or from the direction in which it moves or faces, the rear. Plus, ground, which means the solid surface of the earth, is equal to background, which means the area or scenery behind the main object of contemplation, especially when perceived as a framework for it. Background is an example of closed compound word. Runner which means a person who runs specially in a specified way. Plus, up, which means towards a higher position, towards a higher value, number, or level. Results to runner-up, which means a competitor or team taking second place in a contest. Runner-up is an example of hyphenated compound word. Next, high, which means of great vertical extent, great or greater than normal, in quantity, size, or intensity, plus school, which means an institution for educating children, equals high school, which means a school that typically comprises grades 9 through 12, attended after primary school or middle school. 
High school is an example of open compound word. Note that the meaning of those words came from Google and may differ based on context clues or on how they are used in a sentence. Now look around you and identify names of things that can be considered as compound words. Can you now answer these questions? What are compound words and what are the three types of compound words? This is an activity set for you. Identify the words that make up the following compound words. Provide the meaning for each individual word and for each compound word. Basketball, best friend, fireplace, land bridge, mother-in-law. I hope you have learned something today. Happy learning class! See you on our next lesson!